Two-year-old twins Evangelina and Annabella are the picture of health, but it wasn't always that way. Shortly after the babies were born, one of the twins, Evangelina, was diagnosed with what is commonly known as bubble baby disease. It is actually a deadly condition called severe combined immunodeficiency, or SCID. Well, the moment Evangelina was diagnosed was the moment I thought, will I be burying my child? Will I be raising? A twin without her sister? It was, I can honestly say, it was the darkest day of my life. These are kids who, they look normal at birth, but they have no immune system. And so once they get out into the world and start encountering the germs that we all live with, they get overwhelming infections. And until we had treatments, basically every child with skid probably died. Until now, the only cure for skid was a bone marrow transplant from a donor that often carried life-threatening complications of its own, mainly rejection. But now, for the first time, Dr. Donald Cohn and his team at the Broad Stem Cell Research Center at UCLA have successfully cured the disease in a clinical trial by using the patient's blood-forming stem cells from their own bone marrow targeting the very cause of the problem, a defective or missing immune system gene. So just like you need every page in that blueprint to make a house, you need every one of these genes to work right for the immune system to develop. And if you're missing any one of them, you have this, this skid disease. Like the other 18 patients in the clinical trial, bone marrow was extracted not from a donor, but from Evangelina herself. Her stem cells containing the faulty immune gene are separated in the lab, and a modified virus is used to deliver a corrected gene to replace it. Evangelina's repaired stem cells are returned to her in a simple IV to multiply and repopulate her blood supply with a healthy, working immune system. Evangelina was very lucky. She got diagnosed before she got sick. She was in for her transplant when she was three months of age. She was a very little baby at the time. She did fine with the procedure, and since that time, her immune system has really come back to normal, and she's having a normal life. All of the babies in the clinical trial are thriving, and because doctors use the patient's own stem cells, there is no fear of rejection. Evangelina is no longer a bubble baby. She's not a skid baby. She's not immune deficient. The, the girls are my world. And to see them both you now flourish and be normal kids and, and be able to go outside and, and touch and feel things um, it is just amazing. This gene therapy worked for all babies with this form of skid. Dr. Cohn is now using the same groundbreaking method in a new clinical trial for sickle cell, the most common inherited blood disease in the country. Stem cell therapies are working. Um, we, there's great promise for stem cell therapies and for gene therapy. It's taken longer than we expected to get to this point, but it is working and it's saving lives.